What's going on everyone, Mr. Hoddle here from Crypto News. Today, we're going to be talking about how you can make some exciting gains, exploring trading opportunities with flash loans. Flash loans allow you to make so much profit in a single transaction because in an instant, you're able to take out an unsecured loan and negotiate whatever it is you're trying to deal on like a great trading opportunity to then get that arbitrage instantly executed with more funds than you normally would be able to use. Being that the entire thing is in a single transaction, a lot of traders are making a ton of profit utilizing flash loans, which is why I'm making a video dedicated to how you can profit from flash loans. So if you stay with me to the end, drop a comment below and share your thoughts on how exciting the flash loan opportunity is and what gains it's bringing to you. Now, before I get into that folks, 90% of you watching are not currently subscribed. So if you love crypto content and you want wow research in-depth tutorials just like this one then be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on your notification bells that way as i release another one you'll get notified and last thing i need to say folks is i'm not a financial advisor so please 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 always do your own research anytime you're investing in cryptocurrency this video is strictly for educational purposes only The traditional financial industry has been evolving thanks to DeFi technologies on the blockchain. Today, anyone can access the transparent, stress-free, permissionless, and decentralized financial ecosystem to take advantage of the interesting financial services available. Typically, the crypto space has one main goal, which is to provide alternatives to traditional financial services, and so far, they've been doing great. Today, cryptocurrencies are used to transfer value worldwide, and people are trusting code integrity to exchange digital assets investing in coins that peg their value on fiat currencies and accessing crypto back loans and now the new wave of DeFi technologies is adding an extra layer to all these financial services with flash loans a flash loan is an even more specific category of crypto loans that do not require any backing or collateral and of course crypto enthusiasts are flocking around it the concept is without a doubt a truly unique and useful addition to the growing decentralized financial financial offerings. We'll learn in this video what flash loans are, how they work, and how you can use them to make gains. Let's get into it. So what are flash loans? Flash loans are a new type of uncollateralized lending offered by DeFi platforms allowing users to take out loans for different kinds of profit generating endeavors. Traditionally, individuals can get two kinds of loans, secured and unsecured loans. An unsecured loan is a type of loan where the borrower is not required to put up any type of collateral. Traditional financial institutions will only offer unsecured loans to their consumers depending on credit history. On the other hand, a secured Secured loan requires the borrower to put up collateral, which is something of value that the lender can claim as their own if the borrower defaults. Once the borrower repays the loan within the specified duration, he can reclaim his collateral. DeFi protocols such as Compound or Maker allow users to borrow funds, but they have to first take collateral. Typically, such loans are significantly over collateralized, requiring the borrower to stake assets worth more than the loan. This ensures that the user will repay the loan since there's nothing like a credit rating in the world of DeFi, or at least for now. It also mitigates the volatility dangers associated with crypto lending and borrowing. However, the concept of flash loans is entirely different. While it is an unsecured loan, it does not require you to pass a credit check or any other checks. Actually, the prompt execution of flash loans and their repayment are based on smart contracts. The user has to comply with the rules specified in the smart contract for the flash loans to execute appropriately. Also, the user is to repay the loan in the same transaction before the Ethereum blockchain updates the user's account balances. If they don't repay, the smart contract will reverse the transaction, causing it to fail. Of course, this means that the loan is very short term. One can point that out just from its name, which suggests that it's executed in a flash. However, they offer DeFi users the opportunity to make gains depending on what they can do with the loan in a single transaction. Before the the loan session ends, which usually takes a few seconds, the borrower must carry out other transactions or invoke other smart contracts to utilize the loaned funds.
One important point to be aware of is that while flash loans aren't secured, they are still not free. As we've already stated, all related transaction fees must be covered. In addition, flash loan providers have their additional flash loan fees set in place. For example, Aave has its flash loan fee set at 0.09%. Moreover, since flash loans come from liquidity pools, you'll also have to check if the necessary liquidity is sufficient. Having established those, let's now add that you will need to build a smart contract that requests a flash loan in order to get one. Contract will then execute the specified steps and pay back the loan plus interest and fees all within the same transaction. Nevertheless, building this contract requires some advanced knowledge. You may only be able to do it by utilizing your developer knowledge and writing some code. But again, flash loans can still be done without any code thanks to the help of user interfaces. End users can use protocols like Collateral Swap or DeFi Saver to take advantage of flash loans. It's worth repeating that the time between obtaining and repaying a loan is typically seconds. Usually, the transaction is uploaded to the network which temporarily lends the funds to the borrower. If the borrower's deal isn't profitable, he can reject the transaction, but in any instance, the lender gets their money back in any instance. It's safe to say that the lender has always had the funds. However, the user pays blockchain processing fees. At this point, you're probably wondering why you would take out a flash loan since you can't exactly do much with it if obtaining and repayment of the loan all happen in a single transaction that lasts a few seconds. However, the goal behind flash loans is to make profits. Think of the second portion of the transaction when you actually do something with the loan. As earlier stated, you put the money into a smart contract or a chain of smart contracts, make a profit, and then return the funds to the lender at the end of the transaction. DeFi traders prefer this type of loan for profit generation strategies like collateral swaps and arbitrage. Making money with flash loans is typically associated with arbitrage trading. Arbitrage traders profit from small price discrepancies between different decentralized exchanges. Consider the case where a cryptocurrency trades for 50 cents on one platform and a dollar on another. This is a fantastic opportunity for an informed trader who can take out a $50 flash loan on the first exchange, sell it for $100 on the second exchange, return the loan, and walk away with an extra $50 in profit. Consider also that a DAI USDC is trading at a one-on-one -on -one value on Uniswap, but you can buy one USDC with 0.99 DAI on Curve Finance. If you borrow 10,000 DAI, you can trade them for 10,101 USDC on Curve Finance. You can then swap them back to DAI at one-on-one -on, -one on Uniswap, repaying that 10,000 DAI loan and keeping the 101 die difference. However, in practice, fees will be charged and arbitrage trading carries the risk of price slippage. As a result, traders typically trade at high values to cover costs and seek token pools with high liquidity to minimize the risk of slippage. You can also use flash loans for collateral swap that is to exchange the collateral you staked to take out a loan. Basically, DeFi users can swap the collateral they use to take out a loan on a multi-collateral lending app using a collateral swap. Assume you have invested ETH in Maker in order to mint DAI. If you wish to swap the collateral, you can get a DAI flash loan of the same amount you borrowed from Maker. Then pay off the Maker loan with the flash loan, withdraw your ETH, and exchange it for BAT on a DEX. You can then stake the BAT to secure Secure the mint of more DAI on Maker, which pays off the flash loan. In this case, the ETH collateral has been swapped to BAT. Furthermore, you can use flash loans to reduce transaction fees by taking advantage of the fact that flash loans combine multiple transactions into one. Because each transaction has a fee associated with it, fewer transactions could result in reduced fees. Flash loans are relatively new to the DeFi arena, but they have already made an incredible mark. These uncollateralized loans, which are only enforced by code, bring up a whole new world of possibilities in a new financial system. And actually, it's two characteristics that they're uncollateralized and that smart contracts secure them are what make flash loans so appealing. Although use cases are currently limited, flash loans have established the groundwork for 
exciting new decentralized finance applications. However, keep in mind that the loan system has its own flaws. One such flaw is that malicious actors can execute a flash loan attack, which is essentially what it sounds like, an attempt to profit from the lending system. But overall, you might want to try taking a flash loan if you find a trading opportunity to exploit. Well, there you have it, folks. Now you have all the tools you need to take out a flash loan. So if you've ever been a trader and have seen some pretty good deals on arbitrage and wanted to sort of leverage more unsecured funds without taking on too much risk, then follow the steps in this video and be sure to go on your way to taking out a really profitable flash loan. Now, if you've already used flash loans, drop a comment below and I would love to know what your experiences have been with it so far. And as always, folks, if you did find this video resourceful, please smash that like button. It helps the algorithm and it lets me know you care about the content I'm creating. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all on the next video.